But we're talking lightning uh, today as part of our severe weather awareness week. It's the most frequent severe weather threat that we get here in Michigan. And a bolt of lightning is hotter than the sun, as hot as 50,000 degrees. It can strike over five miles away. That's why we always say if thunder roars, go indoors. That's the saying. If you hear thunder, you're likely close enough to get struck by lightning. And it's the five seconds to one mile rule. So if you see the flash of lightning, you count to five, then you hear the thunder. That means that it's one mile away. Um, so when thunder roars, go indoors. You're outside, you're at the park, maybe you're at a ball game. Um, then it's time to head inside. Now, if you don't have anywhere to go, avoid trees, avoid metal, especially fences. If you're at a baseball game, things like that, avoid those areas. That's what lightning is attracted to, tall objects and uh, metal. If you don't have anywhere to go, you're supposed to crouch down into a ditch or a low-lying area. Otherwise, if you go to your car, this is a myth. A lot of people think that it's actually the rubber in your tires that protect you from the lightning. The truth is, it's the frame of your car where the lightning can travel through and then arc to the ground, arc to the surface. So it's not the tires, it's the metal frame of your car, which is why it's important that you don't have a convertible. You're in a, in a metal enclosed frame car to protect yourself from lightning.